for Big West Press. Set the Big West signature base color. Two-time Big West Press. An FCA All West Region second. 2023 preseason top 25 out. Have a day, Jeez Delgadillo. Kill that. I chose Fullerton when I was a senior in high school, actually. I was committed to Brigham Young University for about four years, and then I was unhappy, and I really decided that I wanted to stay home and be able to have my parents come see me every, every game day throughout the week and just be close enough from home that I can go home whenever I wanted, but also just to be here and play at a competitive sport. Big loss for the Titans going into conference. It looks conference. like Cheese is still not in the lineup. Megan Delgadillo is out for the season due to injury. So March 8th, we were playing Baylor. Uh, the first inning, I get a little blooper. And then when I stepped down, my knee popped. And it was kind of like a... And uh, right then and there, like my whole leg went numb. That same game, they took me into the training room, just set me up on ice and was like, something's not right. I think within that next week, they confirmed that it was a complete ACL tear and that I would need reconstructive surgery. It was really devastating because uh, softball is my world. I love doing it. I want to do it for a long time. And so when it happened, I was just devastated. And I felt like, not that I let the team down, but it was just a big part of me that was gone. Lift up. Honestly, recovery was hard, physically and mentally. I think I spent three hours at PT every single day, literally trying to like learn how to walk again, heal to toe. Could not do that for the longest time. For all, it was just draining. We're not, we're not prehab. We're post now. We have to <laughs> post off. Post off. When I hit probably September, and then I got to start working with Tessa, our new trainer. She made an effort to come work out with me in the weight room. And I was limping, crawling, doing everything because I just wanted to be back. And she did literally every workout with me, never missed a day. And once I started being able to like run, jump, go play catch, it was like the best thing ever. And I felt like a kid at a candy store. <sighs> that support was everything. And even like the whole team, like coming back and like, Everyone like not batting an eye. Can't wait to play with you next year. Yeah. Are you excited to play with me? Well, absolutely. I felt like I needed to work harder. This is gonna make you stronger, a stronger person and a stronger athlete. Exactly. And exactly. hopefully she comes back to it just kick. Make her do her machine tonight. I felt like I didn't deserve to especially like opening day, I was like, I don't deserve this because everyone else has worked for months on at all and then no one batting an eye. Like I can't thank everyone enough. First frame, I should say, is Cal State Fullerton gets its first axe at the dish. It'll be Megan Cheese Delgadillo. Like 20 games last year before a season ending ACL injury to The first day back, it was nerve wracking because I was like, what's going to happen? And then my first day back, I was like shaking up there. I was like, oh, this is, I haven't felt this way since my freshman year. And even though I only got a month of preparation, I was like, I'm ready for this. I deserve this, and I'm pitch. gonna kill this. Delgadillo rips one up the middle. Nab the second, the throw on the first. Not in time. Delgadillo beats it out. And the first runner aboard for Cal State Fullerton. When I got on, I was like, wow, like, I'm back. And then I stepped on the spot where I tore my ACL, and I was like, okay, it's not happening again. We're set, we're good and just like the nerves finally went away then. I coached an 18U team and half of them came out for them finally to see me back. Just like seeing like how much of a difference it makes for them, like makes everything that I do worth it. The plate looking for her third hit of the day. It's grounded up the middle and it gets through. How about the leadoff hitter for Cal State Fullerton? She's three for three today. Payoff pitch. Del Cadillo, this one into center field. Or having that day just to have fun and like play the sport again was amazing. Like the fans cheering, heartwarming. I think everyone's gonna say like they want to leave a legacy here, and of course I do. But I want to leave this place better than I came into it. I want to leave a legacy that's more than just softball. I want to leave with friendships. I want to make this place better. I also want to build up the youth of the other people and like be able to do something that 
people haven't like got to experience. And like I feel like I've had so many great mentors over my years of playing that I want to just be able to give back and give back to the game that has given me so much and be able to continue it on. And back with their first delivery. There goes Delgadillo, and you have a new all-time leader in Big West steals. 122 for Megan Delgadillo. The best hitters in this lineup, and she proves it right there. Welcome. Oh, 